everyone. So my name is Linda Kong. Um, originally, I was supposed to graduate with a class of 2010. So that might be why you don't see my name on the flyer. Um, but it's a really long story to why I did not graduate with my original class. Um, and I don't want to be dragged off the stage by Pastor Sean. So <laughs> I have a, um, a short poem to share. <coughs> has been six long years, and as graduation finally nears, I'd like to shout out to the Lord and thank Him for His word. God knows that there have been valleys and storms. With His help, I eschewed college norms. Now there is a light in the darkness and emptiness of the soul. Now I am filled with the Holy Spirit, so full. You pursue this hopelessly lost sheep, the same God that saved Jonah from the briny deep. In the darkest hour and in emergency room. I remember a God who pr promised the love in the earth room. In China, in the groaning of the earth, I heard your voice calling for my soul to death. In a best friend's death, faced with my own mortality, I stood in awe of your promise of eternity and immortality. I now have a perfect heavenly father who enabled me to forgive an imperfect earthly father. A wounded heart healed when it had a hole. A broken family now made whole. Generational curses that only you know is now broken and I am made new. Now that I am reborn, no longer I am alone and forlorn. You are with me in the big and the small because you are God and creator of all. I finally began to feel an overwhelming joy and peace, a revelation that my life has purpose and sense, a realization that I am loved for myself, a love that sacrifices itself. So lead me to the cross where you took up my loss. Now my heart is no longer hollow. Wherever you lead, I will follow. So to God I say, better late than never, <laughs> you are our God forever. Thank you God for Jesus. There is love in everything we do and see.